Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Right, okay. Um, as promised, um, I said I was going to uh, do another tutorial. And this time, I've done a, um, a grain terminal for the loading of wheat um, and corn, etc., etc., uh, onto, onto boats or onto vessels, cargo ships, okay? So I have a crane down there that will manage the, the loading and taking of the grain off the conveying system and then transferring it onto the onto the boat right okay so let me just give you a quick tutorial um, of the uh, tutorial that I'm going to be uploading a full tutorial of the building of this granary right we have uh, our main admin and reception area over here and obviously the company is grain co all right coming into the uh, main reception area we have offices fully furnished which the tutorial will naturally um, include um, all the fittings furnishings and and fittings of each uh, and every one of these offices um, as you can see okay uh, it also uh, includes uh, basically an archive library and then off to the side of it we have our field laboratory which is obviously for staff only and this is where all the test of the grain uh, is carried out that comes in from the field now here we have our main silos uh, with the conveying system above now these silos are basically interlinked with an underground conveyoring system. Uh, you have a loading area at the back where your grain is dropped off uh, by trains and or by trucks. That grain is dropped down and is transported through here to the bottom of the silo. And this mechanism over here uh, literally picks the grain up and drops it uh, within the, the silo. What it also does, it transports your grain, it picks the grain up from the silo and it takes it up into, if I can get up here, into our overhead uh, conveyoring system uh, that we have here at the top. Right, where are we? I'm, I'm getting lost over here, becoming like a, a bit of a maze. Okay, and then coming through past these uh, silos, what we have over here is where our trains um, come in uh, through through the gate into an area, and we have three sections uh, for the trains. This is where your grain is carried through. And then the bottom of the train then opens up, or the, 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 the cots. It drops it down below, as you can see Yeah, We've got a ladder down there. Then drops it down here, that takes it through an underground uh, conveyoring system into our silo. Okay. Obviously, each uh, section over here that caters for the, the trains, we have uh, a test station that checks the, um, the moisture content of the grain uh, and or the corn to make sure um, that uh, the moisture content is, is correct. Then we also cater for trucks coming in uh, from, from the field. And likewise, with the trucks, it's also dropped down a, a, a grid system down here with also, once again, an underground conveyoring system. Test station yet again uh, for testing your the quality and, um, and moisture content. Now, obviously, if the, the moisture content of the grain, okay, is not quite what it needs to, to be, um, obviously your grain is then graded accordingly, and the lower grade is then used for animal animal feed 
But then, so it's not wasted, um, what then happens here, we have a condenser that then uh, heats uh, these smaller uh, uh, silos, which will then uh, remove the moisture or the excess moisture content from the, the grain. Hence, we have a boiler room and a workshop just for that. Here's our boilers over here with our furnaces to provide heat. And of course, a workshop, fully equipped workshop that's necessary to carry out whatever repairs and maintenance. There we go, guys. Um, and as you can see, there's up at the top is our conveyoring system uh, that runs uh, through or links the various um, silos together. Um, we then have a tower with stairs coming up, and then the grain is then transported or the corn down a conveyoring system where um, a crane then picks the, the grain uh, up from the conveyoring system. These sections then open, which allow the grain to be taken up, up through here, right across the end, and then drop down uh, into the cargo hold uh, of the, the boat, or the cargo vessel, should I say. There we go, guys. That's just a quick overview tour um, of my granary terminal. I hope you liked it. And guys, listen, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, share it with with your mates and most importantly please subscribe and hey also leave a comment below and let me know that once i upload the full seven part tutorial on this uh, if you will be interested in building this terminal okay right then guys till next time take it easy and i'll see you around bye